Morse Micro is a semiconductor company and what we're producing is super low power Wi-Fi chips uh, to enable the Internet of Things. There's a whole range of applications. Um, some of the, the best ones for us, the ones we were getting the most market pool, are logistics, um, cameras and uh, agriculture. Uh, so really anything that needs sort of moderate data rates and, and low power. The chips that we were designing for the phones weren't appropriate for the Internet of Things, uh, too costly, too high power, and we saw an, an opportunity there to go in and, and redesign Wi-Fi uh, from the ground up. People have been working on the Internet of Things for, for a long time, and certain parts of the puzzle are quite mature now. The piece that's missing really is that connectivity piece um, to get the, the data from the devices into the cloud. That, that's what we're really focused on. Um, so it'll be exciting to see um, you know, the, the products that, that come out once that, that part of the puzzle is, is complete. Sort of agricultural sensors, logistics sensors, applications like that, there's really no reason not, not to connect these devices because of the, the value that you can unlock by, by connecting them to the internet. But for sensor applications, you could run off a, a single small coin cell battery for, for three years or so. So it's really getting to the stage where it's down to the self-discharge rate of the battery, down to the battery technology, rather than the power consumption of the low power chips. If you've got more sophisticated battery technologies, where the battery will last 10 years, then, then you can certainly make products that, that would last for 10 years on a single battery. We're not shipping yet. We've got some test chips back, which are, are working very well, but we're uh, about 18 months off shipping chips.